Hello and welcome to Arrow's What Is series. My name is Steve Horobin and I manage Arrow's pre-sales team within Arrow's modern data center practice. Today we are going to be asking, what is a tape library? Uh, again, some people think tape's long dead, but uh, it continues to thrive. So we'll look at the tape library, uh, what it is, its uses, its benefits. So a tape library is a, a physical device that contains a number of cartridges and the cartridge contains the tape. So if we go back years and years uh, into the sort of the first birth of tape, uh, you've probably seen on a lot of science fiction films, tapes uh, and there's vacuum columns and tapes whizzing overheads and all sorts of stuff. Uh, reels of big tape, uh, so these are the, the vacuum columns at the bottom. Um, so there's lots of science fiction films showing that sort of use of tape. Uh, it continues, but basically the tape, instead of being on a reel of tape, uh, now has changed dramatically uh, and it is in a cartridge, um, a fairly small cartridge. Uh, there's two types of tape available in the marketplace. Um, there's the enterprise tape, uh, which IBM generally tends to use with their enterprise tape drives. Uh, but there's also something called LTO, uh, which is the linear tape open. And this was an, an open tape format that was developed a number of years ago. A few of the manufacturers got together and said, we need a standard here. So the LTO uh, standard was created and has continued since then. Uh, the, we're up to LTO 9 today, uh, ninth generation. So if we look at the capacity of an LTO 9 cartridge, this is 18 terabytes. And that's 18 terabytes of uncompressed data uh, on a cartridge that's uh, uh, this sort of size, very, very small. So a lot of use for it. Uh, it still helps people back up, transfer data, take it off site, uh, and it has many, many uses. So although people keep saying tape is dead, it's not. It is the cheapest form of backup media available. So even if you're looking at disk drives and high capacity disk drives and the cost per gig, then tape is still considerably cheaper than what you can get from disk drive these days. So there is still a benefit for tape in the marketplace. If we look at a, a tape library, I think most of our diagrams start with a 2U device, uh, fits as normal into a 2U rack, sorry, fits into a 2U space in a rack. Uh, and what we tend to have here is a cartridge uh, carousels or cartridge drawers that fit into the left and the right hand side of the unit. In the center, there'll be an LCD display and a few buttons to be able to uh, stop and start and load cartridges. If we take out one of the uh, trays on the left-hand side here, for example, uh, this is where the cartridges will fit. So you'll have the cartridges sitting inside this rack, or tray, whatever you want to call it. Uh, and you can fit, I would say, probably up to 12 cartridges inside that. So once you put the cartridges into this tray, then you slide that into the front of the tape unit. Same on this side as well. So internally, if we have a look at it down from the top, uh, you will see inside, there will be the, the drawer with all the tapes in on the left-hand side, the drawer with the tapes in on the right-hand side, and then in the rear of the unit, we will have some tape drives. Uh, so the one system here I'm looking at can have three tape drives in the back. Uh, so you, you can position the tape drives side by side. Uh, and then you have some robotics uh, with a, a gripper arm that sits in the middle. And this, the robotics move up and down inside the center of the tape library, collecting a tape, moving the tape back, sliding the tape into one of the three tape drives. Uh, and then that tape drive becomes online and active. So what you're able to do then is to backup data, restore data, uh, and it's a very, very convenient, uh, two year, I think this is three year actually. So a convenient rack mounted three U tape library. So I'm gonna have to pause there, I'll blow me shog. Uh, right, uh, where were we? 
Okay, so I think that's given you a brief understanding as to what a, a tape library is. Uh, these devices are expandable. So uh, again, if we have a, a main unit inside a rack, uh, we can expand sort of three more units above it. Uh, we can put three more units in below it. So again, you're increasing the drive count. You're increasing the capacity you can manage with the tape drives inside this system. Uh, you're increasing the number of tape drives. Each of these units will enable you to put three tape drives in the rear. Uh, so there with the seven units, you have to 21 tape drives into that size unit. So uh, quite a considerable uh, size backup device. Still in use by a lot of organisations today. So something not to dismiss if people are talking about uh, a means of protecting data, but also a means of uh, ejecting tape cartridges and being able to take the media off site. Okay, so this is part of Arrow's What Is series. Here we've had a look at what is a tape library, and I hope you'll join me on the next video. Thank you very much.